my grandmother uh, would see the KKK in person. They never heard her or anything. Matter of fact, they would bring toys and food down to the black community in Christmas time. And also I think on the fourth. 12 seconds later. You're telling me because your grandpa had a house can, that it didn't happen? Sir, sorry, sir yeah. you can read books. Your individual sir, family. Sir, sir I mean, even if I grant wait, wait, you. Wait, sir, sir, hold on, sorry, let me, let me get the question now. The answer involves like nah, 50 I'm million giving, things, you, like lead contamination in households can have sir, a massive predictor yeah. on whether or not people grow up to be cr criminals. Like, this, 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 sir, this, this, is like how, this is how you have a debate. She's Cuban, or 60 years ago, and then Exactly. My, point proven. No, you, you you can't prove a point by a one-off example. You, you actually me, are. You, you're sir, saying that- Sir, sir, you're trying to bat me into this race realism corner and you're trying to say, well, why did they do it? Why did they do it? You're trying well, to get me to say that. Wait, sir. I mean, why don't you care? Because you I'm looking for- I'm, 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 you, I'm, Sir, 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 hold on. Okay. I'm over here chilling, man. You seem like you're just- you well, know, I know you're chilling because ignorance is bliss. So of course you just say dumb shit after dumb shit. And of course you're super chill because well, it all makes sense to you. Say, What's, you what's are not true? representative of a class of people. That's not how data for, works. Sir, for when, Asians, you people, China, when you make a trans-specific journey, when you make a trans-specific... Sir, sir, sir. Very excited. Me I'm not excited, point. sir. I would like to point out that you literally just had... You, that's what you did. Do you acknowledge that you just did that? Sir, you just had nah. the bigotry of low no, expectations. No, 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 no. Sir, I think I've proven my you, point. I'm I would like to move on. It can be very difficult for you to make a decision that's not that. Wait, I totally so, agree. I totally okay. agree with everything you just said. So my point if is, if you have an to, environment, way, wait, no, no, wait, wait, sir, please let me. No, I'm gonna tell you something. Oh, excuse me, sir. The... Sir, are you saying I didn't have 20 black friends that went to schools? We talking about no, 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 stop. Hold on, I, excuse me, sir. I need to finish this point. A lot of times, a lot of times, the basketball court people get shot at. <laughs> I'm for real. <laughs> I mean, I'm serious. Good. What's your rational justification that there are causal connections between events? Uh, that that I can observe them? No, that's a fallacy, sir. The proof of God is that without him, you, you can prove nothing. Now, can you prove something without starting with the existence of the Christian God, sir? When I try to justify this to some extent, to say that I believe that this foundation of which I build my views is, is valid and I appeal to my senses, you tell me that I'm not allowed to use my senses to, to justify anything. Though. I didn't mention senses, sir. Is the statement like, I think, therefore I am, is that a circular no, sir, statement? No, sir, you, you just completely ignored my question. Would well, I yeah, No, I agree that it's circular. Can but I finish I mean... my response, please? Yeah, sure. Okay. That's pretty much what Christians do, no? No, do you do you accept that line of reasoning, sir? No, I don't, because I don't think that... Good, it... then, why do you, then why do you accept causality, therefore causality? Because I think a belief in God is, is is on a higher level than a fundamental sir, assumption. Sir, the, so, like, no, I I feel like in terms of one like, is fallacious than the other fallacious, sir. I don't I don't agree that you can equate these two things. The materialistic. Sir, it's, they're both circular. <laughs> Okay. Darth, Darth. Bye, everybody. Darth, Darth, again, I, do not interrupt. I don't think we can start with the existence of God and then evaluate the, the logicality of, of senses. I don't, I don't think you could start from that foundation. Sir, oh, sir. I don't think I'm equipped to have this conversation. I, I don't know how to, well, how well, to price sir, this in any greater sir, way. What's, yeah. the, what's the difference between saying causality, therefore causality, versus Martians exist, therefore Martians exist? Because causality, therefore causality, is a, is a fair axiomatic statement that I think 99% of why, people... Why is Can I finish my answer, Darth. please? We're going to be circularly, circularly well, running around Well, sir, sir, your second, your second oh, answer God. to me yeah. was just simply a complete repeat, repeat of just simply filibustering and avoiding the question. Yeah, that's not a, that's not an argument, sir. Okay. W whatever foundation I I you build your beliefs off of is going to be just as arbitrary as mine. Do you not acknowledge that? Okay, which is a classic technique to be argumentative to avoid my question. Now, it's not, well, no, 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 it's not a technique. Talking, <laughs> You've been talking 90% of the time, talking. dude. All right, go for it. You how can you know, wait, 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 wait. May, how, I, may I, sir, no, may I finish no, you the definition of the Christian worldview? Wait a second, how can you know? I'd like to finish, this is the fifth time. You are you filibustering me, sir. Okay. <laughs> I'm not, sir, I'm trying, and in fact, hey, go, go ahead. <laughs> Did everybody just hear what he just conceded to? He just I didn't concede anything. I'm, uh, okay, sir, I was just muted, and I would appreciate I'm that sorry. if you would not uh, overtalk okay. me and I'm try sorry. to obstruct my ability to respond. All of the ideas and lines of reasoning that you put forth ultimately depend upon a foundation of arbitrariness. As now, do yours, of you, course. If, okay, yeah. sir, sir, sir. Okay, now, that necessarily entails the falsity of the Christian God. Do you understand that that necessarily follows? Not necessarily, because I don't even no, know. No, no, sir. No, sir. It necessarily. I just said, I answered no. Let I'm me, not. Let me, why are you let me asking me a question you, if I'm not allowed well, to answer? Let me, 
to incorrect, okay? Okay, so then is it possible that the Christian God might exist, sir? It's possible that anything might exist, sure. Okay, and you're just speculating, and in fact, everything that you reason, according to your own admittance, starts from an arbitrary foundation. So okay, therefore, you keep going back to I'm this. not done yet. I'm not well, done you yet. You've over-talked a... me many times. You have over-talked <laughs> me many times. Oh, the whole chain of discursive reasoning from A to Z is, in fact, ultimately arbitrary. That is not a fair good, comparison. Uh, when you uh, say, no, when no, you go sir. To... Mr. Batman, uh, it's, it's all yours. Well, I thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Okay. I teach science uh, and apologetics for all ages. I was just uh, wanting to know, do you believe that evolution is how we got here as a species? Yeah, absolutely. It's hard to differentiate between the two, right? The phenotype is the expression of the gene? No, sir. The genotype is where all the information for any particular organism is housed. Changes happens, happen to the genotype? It may or may not affect the phenotype? Uh, I mean... Uh, no, sir. No, sir. Again, my question is this, is that we know that natural selection, wouldn't you agree, sir, that natural selection can only take place on traits once they are exhibited in the organism itself, in the population? Uh, okay, uh, but I, I got to ask you a question, sir. Do you know what the definition of mutation is? I do, I'm not sure. What, what, what it, can you tell me what you're getting at? or? Well, sir, um, I'm asking you how you get this complex specified arrangement of symbols that's just called information into the genome. Because, sir, again, a mutation cannot give you um, new information. Oh, okay. Well, let me ask you another question then, sir. And, and again, sir, would you agree that you'd have to actually use the laws of logic in order to perform science? It's the law of identity. It's the eternal, universal, and unchanging law of logic called the law of identity. Can you tell me, sir, where does that come from? Um, it, I'm going to guess that's an axiomatic thing that we get from epistemology or something, some sort of... Well, sir, are you saying you believe it just because you believe it? I'm saying that it's a fundamental assumption of, of formal logic that is unjustified. I think that most of those things are. Oh, no, sir. Actually, it's a, a requirement of the physical world for the physical oh, world to boy. be here. Hold These on, laws are we, of logic. Are we running down the hole sorry, again? No, are you really a, a teacher we're, we're in the public school system? Absolutely I am, sir. I, I absolutely am. Well, let me ask you a question, sir. Let's go back. To, since you don't want to talk about logic, let's go back and talk about natural selection. Sir, how does new information come into the genome? Have we ever observed new information coming into the genome? Considering every single educated scientist believes this, I would imagine so, yeah. Actually, no, sir. That would be false. So, sir, how do you explain new information in the system? I'm not able to do so. Um, can I ask you a question? Can you point me to any published literature you have on this topic? Well, sure. It's all over the place. It's called the Bible, sir. No, 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 the no, no, Bible no, no. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I can, can, excuse me, sir, 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 sir. If you, if you work in so an academic, no, no, no. I don't care to listen to laymen or clergymen speculate uh, on these matters unless you've got published literature that's like peer reviewed in the field. Sir, did you say that you did not know anything about evolution and that's why you didn't want to address this? Sure. If you're not wanting to take my information, and I teach science, sir, so that's okay. We don't have to do that. We don't have to do that, sir. No problem whatsoever. Can, can no, you tell no, me? No, I'm not avoiding your question. No, no, I'm, no. Actually, I'm actually telling you, sir, there's a scientific law. I don't care to listen to a clergyman speculate. I just don't care. Well, sir? What? If I may, are you familiar with how a scientific law works? Sure. What about it? about it? Well, sir, can you tell me what a scientific law is? A scientific law, sir, is a pattern observed in nature repeatedly and exclusively without contradiction. This is known as a scientific law. Sir, we have the law of biogenesis. Are you familiar with the scientific law of biogenesis? Sir, I'm a teacher of science. I can teach any grade. Can you tell me where you graduated started, from and with what sir, degree? Sir, 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 can I can teach any grade from kindergarten through seniors in high school, and I can teach any subject from science I don't, to social I don't studies. care what I the curriculum in Alabama science, says. You know what I'm sir? asking sir. you is what sir. is your educational background to contradict the scientific community? I want to know what you graduated with and where you graduated from. I don't care if you can teach a, a private school in, in Alabama or Tennessee. I want to know what your educational background is. Sir, I teach me? at a public school, and I'm asking you about a law of science. Sir, you don't have to be a scientist to ask a person. A layman can ask you a about a scientific law, observable, repeatable, testable, repeated exclusively without contradiction, with never seeing its contradiction, sir, because if you ever see its contradiction, it's no longer a scientific law. 
So we have a scientific law known as the law of biogenesis. How do you account for that with your worldview of materialism, sir? But it's a very easy way for your appeal to authority theorists. is fallacious, sir. It's absolutely not. Yours is, too. What authority are you appealing to, sir? To the consensus of the scientific community. Now, wouldn't you agree, sir, the definition of truth is that which comports to reality, that which is real? Sir, would it matter if I, a lowly brain-damaged elementary school teacher, was able to find something that science didn't know versus somebody like, oh, I don't know, Stephen Hawking's if he was still alive, if he could find something? What difference would it make? The difference is that if you were actually knowledge. discovering... Difference, the sir, difference sir, is that I'm if... not done. Why do you talk over people? Is your position so weak, sir? <laughs> oh. I've waited patiently. I've waited patiently for you. So, sir, is your position so weak that you cannot wait for a brain-damaged individual like myself? You already asked that. I didn't even cut you off. Hold on. I just have to see real quick. In the general chat of this Discord, if he's talking more than me, can you type one? And if I'm talking over him a lot, can you type two? I'm just curious because maybe my perception is really fucked here. Oh, I believe it is, sir, because let me ask you again. Would you agree that truth is that which comports to reality? Truth is that which is real. Sure. I, I, this how is do really you know boring. That, I, do, I don't, I don't want to do this. This is too boring How do you know that, sir? Can you tell this. me yeah, how you know that? There's too true. many memes for me, dude. I can't. Hey, what's up, buddy? Oh, good to see you here. Would you like to continue the conversation? Yeah, I absolutely would. I have okay, a do you better, want to start better working where, vocabulary. You want to start where we left off? Um, no, we can actually start from the very beginning. Do you realize that you're talking in a circle? I'm, I'm or do you not believe you, you are? I'm waiting, I'm waiting for you to falsify the Christian God, sir. And now you're asking me why God doesn't exist. Do you, do you want to talk about whether yeah. or not we can presuppose yeah, those things? I, listen, or? sir, if you, listen, if you, th you see, I debate hundreds, if not thousands of people over the last couple of years. If you think your evasiveness is, is going to schmooze me over, it's not going to happen. I'm now, not being evasive. I, I'm trying I, to I asked you a question, sir. Can you falsify the Christian God? Do you understand that you're talking in a circle? Can you falsify the Christian God, sir? Are you are you just a troll? Is this all? I I say that I have presuppositions, and you say those presuppositions necessarily entail no, that God is not real. Something that you imagine because it doesn't cohere and conform to the Christian God. Therefore, the Christian God doesn't exist. If that's your argument, sure. No, sir. That was a question. It wasn't an argument. It sounds like you're just rephrasing what we've already stated sir, five sir, minutes sir, ago. Listen, there's only so much evasiveness I'll put up. I'm not with. being evasive what, at all. Okay, <laughs> one more time. One more time. No, yes, sir. No, I Did don't. I reject. That? I reject okay, your good. characterization of my okay, argument. Good. So can I rephrase my argument? Can I rephrase my argument? Sure. Go ahead. Okay. So epistemologically, we cannot evaluate whether or not presuppositions are true or false. It is not possible for humans to do. For you to summarize you that position, possible? for you How to you summarize that position, can I finish my statement, please? Sure. For you to evaluate that statement and claim that it's the same as just simply saying, I don't know, is an incredibly harsh characterization of what I'm saying. Okay, do you know what's possible, sir? Okay, no. good, good. So just for, I will, I will explain to you justifying the Christian worldview momentarily, but okay. I want to go on record here. It's but already you, been on record, sir. Please, Nobody please is hiding. Please do not over talk me. If you over talk me, I'll server me at you, okay? Oh, boy. So, can, can I stop and ask you questions? Because I don't want to hear you preach for two hours again. If not, I, I, I have no I, I, interest. I, 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 okay. I didn't even. I didn't even finish. I don't. I don't need you to finish already, this. Okay, I don't want. I don't want to have to server mute you, sir. So you I, I don't want to listen to you preach. I don't want to have to. Right, server. Calm down. Calm down. Okay. Calm okay. down. Okay. Okay. Calm down. Okay. I, I server mute. Stop. Okay. Stop. Okay, my question is, can you justify your presuppositions without talking about the whole history of your Christian faith? I'm just, I want you to justify your presuppositions. So, for example, you interpret the divine word of God by reading it in a Bible. How can you trust your senses there to lead you into to some kind of like a, a, like ability to perceive words on paper? How can you justify that presupposition? Okay, sir, you're asking more, you're asking yeah, more that was a little bit question. Low, okay, shit. listen, yeah, you need, you need to listen destiny yesterday you were not appealing to epistemological circularity unless of course you want to change your mind right now. no i believe i was playing the same thing do you have anything else to say okay, so far as justifying you, your you, pre presuppositions you, otherwise it's not, we're done with this discussion do you have any sir, other way sir, to justify sir, your presuppositions okay. no the justification for anything ultimately that it conforms with the mind of god and how it has been uh, revealed through god's revelation now what oh, okay well what because is I don't, your oh, sorry, no, hold on a second please don't over talk me how is it the case that there are causal connections because it's presupposed. Can I ask you a question? What, do you what think the, that what the, what do, when you say it's when you say it's I don't want to play this for ten hours? Can no, I ask no, you a sir. question, or are no, you going to ask sir. me a million well, more no, questions? You're not, you're not going to talk over me. You're not going to bulldoze over me, dude. 
Okay. I'm not. You're no. the one bulldozing. Uh, you're not. You're not. You're not. You're I don't not want to run down this this do path. Not this fallacious you, path. Okay. All right. You're server muted. Please do not overtalk me. Okay. Now, do you assert that there are causal connections? Am I only allowed to answer questions for the rest of the time? You're are talking? you are Are you asserting that there are causal? All right. Connections? I think I've proven my point that your are you presuppositions there are, are unjustified. Are you, are you asserting? I'm that not going to play this game, dude. Okay. Goodbye. Thank you. See Thank you later. For your time. Yep. See, this is the name of the game, folks. Is once they get confronted with their crap.